Hello everybody, this is Ariane Arsenault from La Fée de la Mer, Handmade Soaps in the Magdalene Islands, Quebec, Canada. Today I am making some face and hair nourishing oils. Um, I've already made one with lavender and the one that I'm about to do is our Islands Nettle and Rosemary and Lemon Essential Oil Blend. This one we formulated for people who have a normal to oily hair type. It is mainly composed of rose hip oil from Paris Fragrance USA. We love these amazing luxurious oils and exotic butters that they send us. And also another key ingredient that is in all of my nourishing oil is our homemade nettle olive oil infusion. So um, this olive oil has been infusing with locally harvested and grown nettle. And nettle is a hair loving plant. So it's very nourishing, very soothing to your hair. And also, we're going to be using some daikon seed oil. This comes from MissDoyles.com. And this will kind of replace silicones in hair care. So it adds a really nice slip. It helps to detangle your hair. It offers a really nice glide. And it's really great for your hair. Uh, I use it in many of my shampoos, many of my solid conditioners, and in all of my nourishing oils. I'm also using some argan oil and jojoba oil in this blend because argan oil is really, really good for your hair. It's very moisturizing. Uh, it protects your hair from the elements. And then the jojoba oil is a dry oil, just like rosehip oil. Rosehip oil is a, considered a dry oil, so it's nourishing and moisturizing, but it absorbs really quickly and it doesn't leave a greasy feeling. Now these oils are meant for your face or your hair, but if you're a bearded guy, feel free to use them on your beard as well. If your girlfriend has some on the counter, try it. You'll love it. Just a few drops, rub it between your hands, put it on your beard or on your hair. Don't put too much. A little goes a long way. Now I'm going to tilt the camera down and we can just um, take a look at how these are made. They're super easy to make, uh, but they're very, very great on your hair and face. Plus it's like a two in one. Whenever I hop out of the shower, I'm done washing my hair, I put some on my hands, I just rub it, apply to the dry spots on my face, and then finish with the tips of my hair because I have really dry hair. In my stock pot here, and this is a cold mix. So I already have my daikon seed extract. I have my olive infused with nettle oil. The argan oil is already in there. I've already added my jojoba. And I'm gonna add the rosehip oil. Now rosehip is like almost, almost 50% of this recipe uh, because we really aim for this one to be best suited for oily hair and oily skins and this is what will offer uh, the very like quick absorbing properties of this nourishing oil. It is a beautiful color too. This is an unrefined rose hip. So if you ever use rose hip and it is not um, this color, it's because it's been refined, but this one is unrefined and it's beautiful. Now I'm gonna tear my scale and we're gonna go ahead and add the rosemary and lemon essential oil and I'm using essential oils from Plants Power. And by the way, um, I do some, I did my nettle infusion in olive oil, but I have another one that I made with sunflower seed oil that is from um, Plants Power. And um, I will be making new products with it soon. I'm just letting it infuse with the nettle a little longer. The, the longer the better. <laughs> okay. So. Rosemary essential oil as well as lemon are both very balancing for oily complexions and hair. So this is why we're using it in very, very little amounts. We don't want this to smell too much. We know that many of our customers do like to use um, other products on their hair to make them smell good or perfume or on, them, on their skin. So we try and keep our nourishing oil very, very, very lightly scented. And then the lemon. There we go. And I'm gonna end with vitamin E. Vitamin E is an antioxidant. It's very great for your hair and it also helps to prolong the shelf life of the oils in this mix. Now I'll 
I've got left to do is to mix and combine very well. So I'm going to mix for about a minute and then I'm going to bottle these. Here are the three nourishing oils that we carry here in store and I'm just finishing mixing up this batch and I'll be ready to um, bottle these. So I have all of my little amber bottles lined up and we like to close these with a um, lotion dispenser type of a pump so it's really really easy to ch take just a little at a time and not have too much in your hands. That's it, now that the oils are in the bottle, I'm just gonna take my little pumps and put them on. There's no waiting time, there's no cure time. These are ready right away. Uh, all that we will need to do is to put their label on and they will be on our shelves and available in store. Before applying my label, I make sure that there is no oily residue on any of my bottles by wiping them down with a, um, this is like a static or I don't know how you call these, anti-static wipe. We home print all of our labels and I really like these. They are weatherproof so they don't like run under the shower if they ever get wet. Well, this product is not meant to go in the shower, but um, if it would be wet for different other products that we do have that could go in the shower, they just stay put. Our rose, jasmine, and nettle hair and face nourishing oil is made with Plants Powers Jasmine and Rose Absolute, and these were gifted to me when I was in Toronto, and these exquisite essential oils are so precious, and we use them in this oil because they're just lovely on the hair and they smell beautiful. We're going to be stirring again for about a minute to make sure that everything is well combined and dispersed and we will bottle this up. That's it. This is how we make our nourishing oils for face and hair. I would like to thank Paris Fragrance USA for sending me these amazing samples for free of exotic oils and butters. Um, I will show you more throughout my videos whenever I have the time to try and test them. Um, also, thanks to MsDoyles.com for her amazing products, Plants Power, um, for the essential oils. And by the way, they didn't give me this one. They do give me samples once in a while, but I, I buy my essential oils from Plants Power. I just want to thank them because they have such an amazing customer service here in Canada. Um, it's summer. It's officially started. If I don't upload as often as usual, this is because I'm extremely busy. I'm actually super busy never worked so much in my entire life we have so many people walking in products are flying off our shelves i will be closing the web store for a few weeks this summer so if you need anything like hop online lafeydelamer.com because i will be closing shop at the end of july for the rest of august um so yeah <laughs> make sure you check it out if you need anything and we will be back early september and I will try to make videos once in a while, so the summer shorts are also officially started, which means less edited, uh, made with my phone quickly, and sometimes a little shaky, but I'm, I hope you enjoy the content of the summer videos. I will see you again very soon, I hope, whenever I have time to upload. Bye, take care.